Like any American, you have worked hard to build yourself up in your professional and personal life, investing in your career and family to be the best that they can be. You are proud of who you've become and are willing to protect it at all costs. That is precisely why you should invest in an LLC to make sure that your family and business are secure. Let's go. An LLC or limited liability company is a way to protect the members from any potential issues the company may be facing. So if the company is dealing with a large debt or impending lawsuit, the personal assets of the members will not be affected. This can be huge because there are many individuals out there that own their businesses under their own name. And should any lawsuit happen, they can potentially lose all of their business assets and personal assets, potentially losing everything. What's more, LLCs are not taxed on their profits directly. Their status is a pass-through entity, meaning that all profits or losses of an LLC go directly through the company and to the member's specific individual tax returns. The members will then report their shares of the profits and losses, and this feature is great because it avoids the common issues of double taxation that corporations usually deal with. Perpetual existence is another fantastic aspect of an LLC. Unless stated otherwise in the Articles of Organization, an LLC will not be dissolved if the owners change. So regardless of if a member leaves, retires, or even dies, the companies can continue to operate as normal. This feature ensures the stability and longevity of the company. LLCs also have a very flexible management structure. Members are not obligated to run the company themselves and can hire managers to handle the day-to-day -day operations. Managers can be members, but it's not required. This allows the LLC to grow beyond the select amount of members and can be able to function on a larger scale. Now that you've learned about the excellent benefits of an LLC, how do you form one? Well, it's actually pretty easy. First step is choosing a name. You want a name that is unique and also complies with your state's rules and regulations. Naming your company Coca-Cola with K's instead of C's will probably not get you too far. Next, you'll need to file the Articles of Organization. Now, this paperwork will contain all of the basic information on your LLC. So, names, address, purpose, and information on the members. Next, create an operating agreement. Now, this is not required, but it makes sense to outline how the company will be structured. This may include ownership structure, management responsibilities, voting rights, profit distribution, and more. Clarifying these issues from the start can prevent issues from forming down the line. Next are necessary fees. So in order to create your LLC, you will have some costs, usually in the form of filing fees, and they will run you a few hundred bucks. Next are permits and licenses. So depending on your business and your location, you may need some additional licenses to operate legally. So contact your local government and do some research to see if this is the case. Next is the publish notice. So in some states, you are actually required to publish the formation of your LLC in the newspaper. Seems a little odd and old fashioned, but it doesn't take that much, so it's really no big deal. Next is your employer identification number, or EIN, which is your federal tax identification number. This is required, and you can apply for it for free on the IRS website. And yeah, that's basically it. Make sure to comply with any changes in the law, file your annual report, and pay your annual fees, and it should be smooth sailing from there. Something to note, with an LLC, your protection is not absolute. Engaging in illegal or fraudulent activities or not maintaining a proper divide between personal and business finances can get you into serious trouble. An LLC is there to give you an additional layer of protection from unknown outside forces. No one ever wants to see their personal assets or family's business legacy go up in smoke. So with that, I'm Evan, and thanks for watching. If you like what you just saw, then click on the video here. Also, if you haven't, like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon so you don't miss any future videos.